thing to do. Hey, making me look pro. There you go. Other medevac coming in, and they're all pretty low energy. Factory seeing everything. It is burning now, so that's probably a goner since I don't foresee it getting killed. Colossus is... They see the Colossus, and they're just going to try to kill it before it can react. However, these pros, they are very fast with their reaction time. A Viking moving in, and not much he can do to stop that. So he is getting a few stalkers in here to snipe that Viking, hopefully. However, those Marauders do so much damage to the stalkers. Getting the, getting the Viking killed, now the Colossus just going to town in the back, protected. And having to pull back again. Meaty does have his expansion back up and running, however, White Raw's almost back up to City on 3. Vision granted by this tower here. It seems like a waste to have this Marauder sitting here, except White Raw still has not attacked it, and that lovely control of the tower let him see most everything. Well, it let him see a lot. Now, these uh, mules, these mules do mine very quickly, so as you can see down here, these mineral fields are running low. For him, White Raw is also running low. At the expansion, at the expansion, White Raw is running lower. I don't know why he's left his stalkers here. Probably in case of a drop, seems like a waste. However, he was able to hold back everything, so great for him. Another warp prism coming out for White Raw. A cannon. I don't know where the cannon's going. There's the cannon. Just in case of a drop again. Factory coming down. Three medevacs full of units. And what is he trying to do with these? I'm guessing trying to get in here, but if he loses even one, then it's not going to be worth it. Four Stalkers will put a hurt on these medevacs. Observer coming out, and he'll see this guy. I'm not sure if he's just he's just trying to see where those medevacs went. His army, his main army is still here. He does have those four Stalkers and a cannon coming down. So with that, he will see, and he'll try to still get them off anyway. I think he got all the units out of that medevac before it hit, and so these this drop will do a lot. He did lose one of his medevacs, however, he will likely be able to either get this killed or close to Colossi, Colossi in the back, doing some damage. Stalkers and Zealots moving up. He can't lift up because if he does, these Stalkers have the potential to just drop the medevac, and he did get away 20, 20 hit points. Not much, but enough, and he dropped the expansion making the income just about even. In fact, Meaty coming out ahead on gas by a lot. So we will see what happens. A little engagement up here, not too much, just trying to gain control of that tower. Forced to pull back. In terms of army, let's take a look at this. White Raw slightly ahead in terms of both army and workers, sitting with this second expansion up and running. The third going back up this medevac full of stuff will potentially be a problem however it only has 20 hit points so one shot from this cannon will kill it if he's not careful engagement coming on down here he does have a few sentries guardian shield up that is a lot of viking and those will definitely hurt that colossus if they can get a hold of it forced to pull the colossus back trying to get these vikings killed with his stalkers over these marauders doing so much blowing up all of his stalkers he has no more stalkers left he can't do anything about that. Force fielding in his Marauders. Zealots, what he has left, going to town. If these can get here, they'll do a lot. Colossus is AoEing. That Colossus hurts any ground unit. Doesn't matter which you are. He'll hurt them very much, though. And with his Vikings killed, he's forced to try to rely on his Marauders. However, they were all force field in around these things. Look at this. Moving up and Colossus doing what it can. Getting killed. However, he did lose a bunch. Pulling them up into the medevac, great micro, seeing all that, and that is only zealots, and getting them killed. Now concussive shells trying to kite them around, and going for his third expansion out here. We have more colossi being built, we have a ghost academy, and more marauders, so very fun game so far. I am definitely enjoying it. Look at all of these barracks, a few reactors, a few tech labs, and a hell of a lot of fun. White Rod destroying these rocks, this will just let him access the base of Medium much more often. And Drop coming in, avoiding the cannon, very smart. If he can take out this pylon, this cannon will still have power, but it still is an annoyance. 
and trying to take out that robotics bay. He takes out that robotics bay. That means no more colossi. And here's one colossus shredding what he can, and that is actually that is actually destroying a lot of his units. He did get the bay killed out, and he is pushing very hard here. So there will be no more colossus in production for White Raw at the moment. And he is doing a lot of damage to this army. Can he get the Nexus killed? He got the Nexus killed, but he lost everything he owns. I'm not sure if that was worth it. On one hand, he will not be up against any more Colossi. And Wyra is down in expansion. All the while, he is getting the third of his own and pushing hard. He doesn't really have much of an army to counter it. Pulling in the SCVs, which these Colossi just tear through like they were paper. And... White Raw now going to snipe out these Vikings. Colossus in the back just tearing up his base. And very good game. Very well played. It was going to be very close at the end with these ghosts coming out for me. However, the Colossus that he had, the Zealots and the Stalkers, good micro. And he just had the economic advantage the whole time with three bases. Meaty was just getting his third and there was not much he could do. So, this is game one. I have a couple more between these two, and if the other two are as good as this one, I cannot wait to see. Once again, I am Zord, and I hope you all enjoyed it.